Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel. Today we're getting the CTR tokens of Glacier Park. And I think all things considered, I had an easier time with these CTR tokens. Um, though there were a few that were just bad, beyond all reason. They did not need to be that bad. Um, yeah, like we'll, we'll get to those when we get to them, but we're starting off with Blizzard Bluff. And honestly, the tokens weren't too bad here, you know. Um, you had uh, the dude that it was the sea? No, the sea was on the ice, which wasn't that bad to get. Um, the R was like right before the little wooden uh, bridge which also wasn't hard to get and then the T is close to the beginning which I've probably already got by this point in the video and it's just like slightly off road nothing too bad like my difficulty was just coming in first like you don't really have to go out of your way to get any of those uh, CTR tokens dragon mines however can burn um, the C was in that section closer to the front with the water. You just get that by drifting or just get it, like drive to it normally. You don't really lose any time there. The T, however, it's on the spiral wooden section and it's off said spiral wooden section. So you kind of have to get to the upper part drop down to the lower part and get it as you drop down. Uh, I would try to just go for this in my first lap and if I missed it then that was just an instant restart because it was that that was just a mean one and I say the first lap because like by the second and third lap you know like the places are a little more defined people aren't really grouped together so losing time at that point is a bit more detrimental it's not insurmountable but it is like more trouble than i was willing to deal with and yeah that was just a really bad token to get and the r was in the section with the little like wooden pillars where you have to sort of like weave in and out it's right where the uh like uh, minecart shortcut ends and converges with the main path that R isn't too difficult to get it can just be easily missed since it kind of blends in with the surroundings um, polar pass was interesting uh, the T and the R are off of uh, jumps uh, the T being like the jump at the very end of the level and the R being like in sort of like the first quarter, second quarter, where there's just a series of jumps with the little speed boost ramps, and the C is in that little figure eight section. Nothing too difficult to get here. Um, I just had to restart a few times because I was missing the uh, like great shortcut near the end that was my key to victory <laughs> when I played the course normally. And, yeah, like, I, I would mess up on, like, the third lap, and at that point, it's just like, well, there's no way I'm bringing it back this close to the end of the, uh, course. Maybe I could've, but, I you don't know, I had to restart a few times, but, yeah, these tokens weren't particularly hard to get. I was just screwing up the shortcut. And Tiny Arena, there's not much to say here, because there's no real shortcuts for them to have thrown the uh, tokens on and they all were kind of out in the open so yeah um, no major difficulty there with finding the tokens it's just the normal stage like seriously you don't have to go out of your way for any of them um, so yeah that's it for <laughs> these there's very little to say about these tracks compared to the uh, previous ones. It's just Dragon Mines. That one was 
That was not good. That that tea was was not good and was genuinely frustrating, but at least I don't have to deal with it anymore. Um So yeah. <laughs> Enjoyed the uh, rest of this here video. I, I I don't have much else to say here. I mean I've already said that. It's it's kind of obvious at this point. And um yeah, I'll see you next time when we get the CTR tokens of Citadel City. Oh boy. Cortex Castle and Engine's Lab. Mm, engine Labs. I can kind of see where there might be some difficult ones. Even with Cortex Castle, like I, I can see where they might position one where it could be really bad to get. I have no idea what to expect for Hot Air Skyway, and I am not looking forward to that. Oxide Station, honestly, the difficulty there would probably be like figuring out where the tokens are, because that, that was kind of like, yeah, the track there was, it, it doesn't match the yellow of the letters, but with the green and the yellow aesthetic it's got going on. I feel the letters could really blend in there, but I don't see where they might hide anything too, like, badly out of the way. Though considering, like, there's a few big jumps in there, there might be some tokens on the edge of those jumps. Uh, but yeah, this is just uh, speculation on my part, as I have yet to even attempt those courses. Which I will get to next time. Or, what? I'm, I'm just saying words now. Yeah, I'm, I'm just all over the place. That means it's time to end the commentary. So enjoy the rest of these here uh, courses as I get those there CTR tokens. And I'll see you next time for some more of this Sprite Cheer Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. Goodbye. Yeah.